So, well, I got two questions for you. One, did you see The Real Housewives last night? Uh, no, I was watching Dallas. Oh, well, then number two, what do you think about all these tech tools that are saturating the educational environment right now? You know, it's fascinating. We've got a new teacher named Kelly. Get out! Yes! What? She takes me back to when I was in the classroom, teaches a me what these... A long time ago. Uh, could have been. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Teaches me how to use these AI tools and things that I could or couldn't do, should or shouldn't do with them. Oh. It's really fascinating. Here's Kelly. Hello, today we'll be going over CuriePod, which is an AI content creating tool for teachers to use. So right here, you can kind of just scroll through um, and see what content it could create for you, or you could just type in what you are teaching and it could come up with some suggestions for you. So I'm going to say subtracting fractions. And here it comes up with three different customizable lessons that I can choose from. So a math word story, building a rocket ship to reach the stars math, or spot the scam. So I'm going to do this math story problem. And then you can come up with um, a story theme. So if all of your students really love superheroes or um, a certain sport or, or a certain athlete. So I'm just going to say Spider-Man. And then you can copy and paste the math standard that your lesson is going over. So here I have um, a math standard for fifth grade. So it's 5NF2. So 5NF2. So I just copied and pasted um, the standard in there and now I will have it customize my lesson. So here it just customized a lesson for me. Um, it created um, math story problems with an engaging story. So as you can see here is the introduction about Spider-Man swinging from building to building. So what I like about CurePod is that um, you can tailor your word problems to the student's interest. For example, I'm a big Swifty, um, and I could interject some Taylor Swift, you know, knowledge or lyrics into the word problem for my students who are also fellow Swifties. That would also help me as a teacher. If I was in the classroom because I'm from a different era. It created this PowerPoint. I can go through and edit it if I want. So here it says Spider-Man caught half of the Green Goblin's gang in the morning and one fourth in the evening. How much of the Green Goblin's gang did Spider-Man catch and in total that day? And then it goes over the solution and then it has a do now in pairs. So it gives them a new problem goes over the solution, etc., etc. So you can just present it straight from this website. You can edit it right here. You can share it with your students or with teachers. On this, you can kind of just um, edit it a little bit more, like edit the background and the theme. Or like I said, you could present it full screen right here and you can freeze it. Um, you can see what students have joined. You can also require real names so that students don't choose something inappropriate. Um, and then up here is the link that the students would go to and the pin number that they would have to type in when prompted. So this was a very um, easy way to create content for the students who follow along with you. Thank you for watching.